What's up ladies and gentlemen and welcome to Aqua Motor Racing Utopia. Today we'll be looking at some basic tips and tricks for a watercraft racing game. Without further ado, let's get to it. One of the most important controls in the game is the sharp turn trigger. If you're using a controller, it's the trigger right here. When pressed, this trigger will slow down your watercraft and make it turn sharper. This is the same turn taken first without the sharp turn trigger and now with the sharp turn trigger. The sharp turn trigger can also be used to control your watercraft in the air. If you use it while your watercraft is airborne, it will allow you to rotate faster, helping you pull up backflips and barrel rolls. To illustrate the difference in rotational speed, there are two clips showing the same jump First without the sharp turn trigger, and then with the sharp turn trigger. While on the topic of jumps and stunts, let's talk about ramps. When your watercraft hits the ramp, you will lose your ability to change direction. As a result of that, it is important to position yourself correctly before you hit the ramp. Taking the ramp head-on will result in a straight jump. This is one of the more basic tips, but buying a new watercraft can improve your lap times. The differences between the watercraft are noticeable and a new watercraft might help you win that one race where you're struggling. Experiment and see what watercraft fits your driving style. Knowing the map and where the buoys are will improve your lap times and make the racing more rewarding. When you're racing a track for the first time, occasionally glance at the minimap in the bottom left corner to see where the next buoys are. Don't be so quick to restart if you fail. Ride the track out at least once just to get a feel for it. Riding a watercraft means tackling the waves. Taking a buoy too fast with wavy waters might mean that you'll be sent flying at an unfortunate time. If you see a wave in front of you and you know you need to turn, it is often good to slow down and gently roll over the wave. Be aware of waves around buoys and adjust your speed accordingly and you will complete the tracks with great lap times. You gain turbo by passing buoys on the correct side. A good pass nets you a small amount of turbo, while a perfect pass nets you a large amount of turbo. Doing stunts will also fill your turbo meter. Don't use your turbo in an area with sharp turns. Instead, try to use your turbo on open waters with little to no turns. That's all for this video. We hope you liked it and that it helped you. If you have any questions, you can type them in the comment section below or you can contact us on social media. Links are in the description. In part 2 of this video, we will cover more advanced tactics that will further help improve your watercraft driving skills. We'll leave you with this gold medal time trial run.